Okay, I've showed you how to add or subtract negative or directed numbers in previous lessons. Now I'm going to show you how easy it is to multiply directed numbers as well. Let's go through the examples and you'll quickly get the hang of it and you'll become a master at this. We have the first example here, negative 7 times 4. We know that 7 times 4 is 28. We have a negative, we have one negative, we put it in the answer because we have one negative in the question, we put it straight in the answer. Then we have 6 times negative 3. Again, same, 6 times 3 we know is 18. We have one negative, we place it in. It's that simple. Negative 5 times 8. You do this one. What's 5 times 8? 40. And we have a negative, we put it in. In this here, we have negative 9 times negative 11. Again, we do the multiplication. 9 times 11, 99. However, we notice we don't have one negative, we have two negatives. Guess what happens? The two negatives, they cancel each other out. They go to the movies. They're gone. So our answer is positive 99. So when we have two negatives, they cancel each other out and they basically go 9 times 11, 99, positive 99. That's how easy it is. Another one, negative 6 times negative 5. So 6 times 5, we know, is 30. Then we realize that we have two negatives, and we said what happens to the negatives? They go to the movies, they cancel one another out, they're gone. Our answer is positive 30. Negative 2 times negative 8. Once again, 2 times 8, 16. A negative and a negative cancel each other out. They go to the movies, they're gone. Our answer is positive 16. Let's look at this one here. Negative 4 times negative 3 times negative 2. Uh -huh. Let's do the multiplication. 4 times 3 is 12. 12 times 2 is 24. Now we know that when we have two negatives, they go, they partner up and they go to the movies. So these two go to the movies, they're gone. This guy here, he's got no partner, Nigel, no friends, he stays. So our answer is negative 24. The two go, see you later, one is left, he stays home, negative 24, there it is. Same concept, negative 7 times negative 2 times negative 2. Let's do the multiplication. 7 times 2, 14. 14 times 2, 28. Now we look at the negatives. These guys partner up. See you later. They're gone. And this guy has no friends. He stays in the answer. Negative 28. It is that simple. Very easy. So once you get the drift and you'll notice it's very easy. If we have one negative, it stays. Two negatives, they partner up. And three negatives, two of them partner up, one stays. And as you can see, if it's an, a negative, it stays here. Two negatives on this side here, they go. And two negatives here, they go. We have three negatives here, two of them go, see you later. And one stays because it has no friends. So that's basically how to multiply negative numbers. Very easy, very straightforward. Remember those rules, you won't go wrong.